Hello everyone, so in this particular video we are going to discuss about how actually we can become Azure Data Engineer what are the skills which is generally required to crack any kind of the Azure Data Engineer role okay so so many people were asking me how actually we can crack Azure Data Engineer what are the skills which is required how actually I can prepare for Azure Data Engineer so that's why I have decided to create one specific video for that okay so let us try to discuss okay before saying anything from my side first let me show you what are the skills which company is looking so I have opened Nokri.com I have searched for the Azure Data Engineer you can see from the tech mahindra side right so if you will see the job description from tech mahindra for the azure data engineer role what actually they are looking is like if you can see design adf pipeline okay so they are looking for even in the primary skill if you can see right in a primary skill they have mentioned advanced sql and the data warehouse okay strong in a sql hands-on experience in a writing complex query azure data factory azure data bricks and azure data lake storage so these are the things actually the tech, tech Mahindra is asking okay similarly if you will look for the other company right so this is the requirement from the TRH consultancy service okay what actually they are looking let us try to analyze so they are looking like so develop new solution on the Azure cloud platform is specific Azure SQL data warehouse okay Azure data factory Azure service Azure data lake and the blob storage okay and in second point also they have mentioned about the Azure Data Factory, Azure SQL Database. Third point they have mentioned about the SQL skills. Fourth point they have mentioned about the data pipeline knowledge, Azure Data Factory, USQL and all. Okay, Azure Cloud Data Warehouse, Azure NoSQL Database and all. Okay, so mostly if you will see right, the mostly the requirement is coming under the Azure Data Factory, Azure Data Lake Storage, Azure SQL, Strong in a SQL okay data pipeline you should know about the etl activity right azure data lake storage right as of now we have seen like this okay let us try to go to the another application okay now this is another requirement from the kpmg now let's see what actually they are looking so if you see in the job requirement what are the skills they have mentioned they have mentioned about the azure data lake storage azure data factory azure data bricks azure sql etl pipelines okay good experience with the data engineering from multiple source like salesforce excel snowflake okay high proficiency in a database language like the sql apis and all okay data warehouse data modeling and all okay let me go to the another so and this is the requirement from the hexaware okay now let us see and let us try to analyze what actually they are looking they are key responsibility we'll see right design development and the maintenance of the data pipeline using azure data factory okay uh, collaborate with the data engineer okay design and development optimize data pipeline for the performance this is under the azure data factory only participate in a data related okay that is also fine so mostly they are looking for the three five experience with azure data factory data engine ingestion transformation orchestration experience with the data integration etl process equal and all okay now in a nutshell if you will see right in nutshell if you will see we have seen about around four companies in a four companies we have seen and mostly what are the skill they are looking they are looking for the sql and this is one of the important right okay so whenever you are preparing right your your first priority should be sql you should be strong in a sql strong in sql and you you should be able to write able to write complex com complex query okay so this is the first requirement mostly the company asks so they will first check your sql sql knowledge okay so that is the first requirement which they will look okay so you should be strong in a sql now second and most important thing is like the azure data factory mostly in all the requirement if you see like they are looking for the data pipeline you should know about the data pipeline you should know about the etl activity you should know about the ingestion right maintenance and all so in every job description this is mentioned so you should know about the azure data factory so that is your second priority okay now third priority is like you should also have a knowledge about the adls that is nothing but our data lake storage or the blob storage right blob storage right and the some data warehouse concept you should know data warehouse concept 
you should know okay so that is the third thing okay now fourth thing is like you should in some company they also look for the pie spark okay pie spark pie spark you should know you should know the basic of the python because this all the things generally they check okay you should know about the pie spark python data bricks okay this is also important this is also important so that should also be your priority okay now in some of the company they also check the tableau power bi right some basic knowledge or some knowledge you should have okay because if you want to crack right if you want to crack it you suppose you are building any reports if you want to give it to your business stakeholders okay so you want to you always want to give into form of the visualization so tableau and power bi this is most use uh, okay so that is why you should also have a knowledge okay so this kind so your first priority should be you should be strong in a sql then you should go for the all the azure data factory you should have knowledge about the storage services and all you should have knowledge about the python pyspark data bricks and uh, at last only time permit then only you should go for the tableau power, power bi okay now the next question is like how actually we can prepare how actually we can prepare for this okay so i have already created a playlist in my channel okay i have already created in playlist in my channel okay so how actually you can follow that okay how actually you can follow that you can open the learn by doing it okay you can open the learn by doing it okay you can see there are so many industry related projects i have mentioned here okay but you have to go to the videos first uh, or the playlist okay in a playlist you have to go under this playlist right and there is one azure data engineer full course azure data engineer full course here 43 videos are there okay here 43 videos are there you have to open this and you have to complete this first right here uh, i have discussed about the data engineer architecture create a storage account i have started with the storage services as and after that i started with the azure data factory that is a important part okay after the idea of all the pipeline and all right uh, everything the pipeline related things i have covered here after that we have started with the data bricks from the 21 so you should also focus on the data bricks and after that you should also see the spark sql because sql is important right that also we have covered and then the we also covered the pi spark related things that you should follow and the some company also ask about the azure synapse and azure synapse is uh, also similar to the <coughs> similar to the azure data factory and the data warehouse right so that's why you should also watch this okay and after that data engineer interview related question i have covered okay so you should cover these things okay now once you will cover this right then we'll go and we'll go move to the project parts so that is the how actually you should go how actually you can um, how actually you can uh, follow and do the projects so for project also i have uploaded so many projects like the azure data engineer project industry level projects okay so these are the projects you should cover the real time industry level project this is also azure related project pi spark related projects you should cover this and also i will upload more videos and i will upload in this particular channel okay and if you have any doubt if you have any question you can comment in the comment section i will reply it okay so that is how actually you should prepare okay if you have any doubt if you have any question you can ping me in a telegram or you can join in a telegram group okay and please do like and support so that i will post more videos like this okay and this will really helpful for you okay you just go through this video and you if you will be having any kind of doubt, doubt you can reach out to me yeah that's it in this video but that is how actually your priority should be okay to prepare a sql right for the sql also i have a separate <coughs> sql tutorial playlist but i will add more videos for the sql also so that it will be easy for you and also if, if you want to prepare like in a very short time right so one video tutorial this playlist you can follow in this one video tutorial i have as of now i have azure data factory and also i have a data bricks and also i have a uh, data bricks i will add more like the sql and all okay pi spark azure data factory and the data bricks is as of now available in a one video tutorial but i will also add the sql python and pi spark okay please do like please do support so, and uh, please share it with your friends so that i will help you and uh, i will add more videos okay uh, that's it in this video thank you